This is uh, an approximation of Tommy Emanuel's um, arrangement of Billy Joel's tune, and so it goes. Beautiful tune, probably one of the best uh, melodies and lyrics and sentiments he's come up with. Uh, it was from Billy Joel's album Stormfront in the uh, late 80s, maybe? I got it floating around here someplace. But anyway, and um, Tommy grabbed it. A lot of people have played this, and and uh, it is, it's just... Again, a stunning melody. The rhythm, we're going to look pretty much at what, at what Tommy did. Everything I did there, I've tabbed out. And we'll talk a little bit about Tommy put together a, uh, he calls it a bridge. They, that is a very, uh, it's, technically it's fairly difficult. It's a, it's, it's a very quick backward roll. Something like that. We'll talk about it. Oh, I do have that tabbed out too. But it's a it's a technique that you'll uh, probably have to work on pretty um, uh, a lot if you want to put it in the song. It is not really necessary as far as I'm concerned. And pretty much everything I played there, there's really just a verse and a chorus. And uh, I just ran through the verse. The, uh, half a verse is essentially what I did, and half a chorus. So there's really it's only like one. The whole thing is only 16 measures or so. About uh, and but but. It's very difficult to make it really musical, partly because the timing is very flexible. It's much more like an old chorale type or piece where um, there are all kinds of, um, of fermatas holding things for, un, you know, so I'm not even sure I have the timing, the, the, the time signature right for everything, uh, for the way I put it together. But I'm going to teach you how to play pretty much what I just did there. So uh, we will take a look over the next couple of segments at Tommy Emanuel's arrangement of And So It Goes. <laughs> 